screen here with Alice. Uh, unfortunately not Laura. Uh, this is just a quick video to announce that I'm going to be doing the Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke and Persona 5 playthrough uh, solo from this point on. Um, there's a couple of reasons for this. It's nothing crazy like Laura and I broke up or anything. We're still, you know, perfectly fine. But um, she's been really crook lately and feeling bad about missing streams when she is sick. There's also the fact that she's feeling like a lot more of her free time is restricted these days with, with how much she's working at her job. Um, and like she's never worked as much as she has been before and she wants to be doing her, her own things when she has the spare time. Um, she's looking into starting up her own wedding planning business. So when she's not doing things like working or sewing or crafting or even just playing games that she wants to play, she's trying to plan for her future and our future. And it's a lot of, like, there's a lot of involved sort of stuff, a lot of research she has to do, um, planning, forethought, you know, monetary concerns and everything weighing her down. So she wants to be able to devote as much attention to her hobbies and her passions as well as her future. Um, the other thing is that she tends to get very emotionally invested with characters and after the last episode, um, particularly of the Pokemon Nuzlocke, she sort of said to me that really hurt. Like, I hate losing friends and stuff, so like she gets really emotionally attached to fictional game characters, which is fine. A lot of us do it. Um, but yeah, so she says it's it's a little bit too painful to keep playing this game when, you know, her friends die and stuff. So, like, you know, that's kind of cute <laughs> in a way. Um, she's got a very soft heart. It's one of her endearing qualities. Um, but this goes for Persona 5 as well. Um, Persona 5, um, while she has enjoyed the journey with me so far, um, mostly... Um, she finds that she only really enjoys some aspects of the gameplay and doesn't enjoy others as much. Like, you know, she's played games like The Wolf Among Us, um, and Heavy Rain and stuff where it's mostly just visual storytelling with only minor input from the player, but she doesn't really like those games where lots and lots of stuff happens and you just watch it happen and the most involvement you have is, like, making a decision and then the rest of the game plays itself. She does like the action sequences uh, more when you're actually battling, but that's just not the whole thing. Um, like, if that was the whole game, she'd probably enjoy it a bit more, but yeah, so she only enjoys some aspects of it and she finds herself getting a little bit bored and weary of the parts, especially when it's very heavy, heavily um, heavy in the story and there's not much for her to do. Um, the other thing is that, you know, the latest character we've um, met and freed from the prison is Futaba Sakura, and she honestly feels like Futaba just hits a little bit too close to home with her, because uh, Futaba represents someone who was very close to her in real life, and is, you know, personality-wise, looks-wise, attitude-wise, past-wise even, is a little bit too similar to one of her real life friends that she isn't that close with anymore um so yeah she doesn't she said she doesn't want to keep playing a game that has a living reminder of her ex-best friend in it so i respect that decision and yeah so for those reasons are uh, listed pokemon platinum and persona 5 will now be done by me solo we may play another game together in the future um, one that's a bit more suited to both of our tastes and isn't quite so ugh with her in the mental department. Um, but that also depends on how busy she's going to be with work and her business and her hobbies and everything. So, uh, yeah, I'm not quitting the playthrough. I'm going to continue solo and persevere until I complete Platinum or die trying. <laughs> um, and I will complete Persona 5 by myself. But hopefully I won't always be by myself. I have uh, the lovely Alice here. Alice? Yeah, good girl. So, she's tended to be here a lot more often in recent streams than in the past. 
So, Alice might be the regular fixture instead of Laura. We'll see. <laughs> okay, that's all I wanted to say for this stream. Um, I'm going to close this one just to make it a short update video for both of the games that I've mentioned in it, and then I'm going to be right back with the Pokemon Platinum stream starting very soon. So, tough for that. And hope you all understand and have a good time. <laughs>